play, Australian region, 15.5. What happened to your hair color? Yo, ah! <laughs> my caddy? What's a caddy? Oh, like golf. Will April carry all your bags today? Definitely not. No, I don't have a bag. Oh, that's right. You never travel with bags. No. Nope. Did you bring your weightlifting shoes? No. I told you to. They're too heavy. I'm already heavy enough. <laughs> nah. Oh, big mistake. I peed with my cleaning big joke. Big mistake. I peed with my cleaning joke twice in my nano, so I don't think I need my weightlifting shoes for thrusters. Do you live in weightlifting shoes? Uh, when I'm lifting weights, yeah, I live in them. I do wear them when I'm lifting, but... No, they help for this workout. I never wear well, weightlifting shoes. If I didn't have them, shoes. I'd be so nervous for the workout. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, she's oh gonna God. do it for like in a few hours. She, you I, I know. You, you, you know I would tell you? No, you, I You'll know, be fine. I know Raph. Yeah. He was no, trying to hurt so bad. Last night, what did you say? <laughs> We're in the sauna and he's like, um, he's like, oh, are you doing 15.5 tomorrow? And I'm like, yeah. And he's like, you shouldn't be in the sauna. <sighs> Why do I feel so sick? She goes, chalk. <laughs> She's like, I don't understand what you're saying. Like, chalk, like what you put on your hands. Oh, chalk. <laughs> Shit! Yes, chalk. Do you don't have any chalk? So, no, none of that. <laughs> no, we don't have any of that. Oh, that's so. That's Rob was so like, silly. What the fuck that's is so amateur. How can those see throw that knife? And we had, and we had. I really thought though that they were a little more legitimate. Don't like, you know the tagline? Safety comes last. <laughs> I'll sit on the floor. Someone go on someone's lap. Oh, holy shit. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> you just sit in the back. I mean, like, in the boot. Do I need to slide my seat forward more? <laughs> nah, slide it back, eh? <laughs> so easy. Good. Okay, lucky you haven't put on weight this year. Hello. Jesus. It's a it's getting real tight. <laughs> broke my sunglasses. Oh my I want to see if that door can close. Dude, there's no way they he's going to do it. No. <laughs> Are we good? all that. <laughs> How's this gonna work? Wait, here, wait. If you turn sideways, you can see that way. <laughs> so, at least Sam is not a very big girl. No, I don't. Yeah, I'll, I'll just keep the door open. <laughs> okay. Oh, yes. Holy shit. Hi, everybody. We're doing it. <laughs> you can sit. Are you doing the podcast here? <laughs> yeah, yeah we done. should do the podcast in the I car. I can't move. <laughs> it took me seven minutes to get on the ground. I couldn't open my eyes and I couldn't walk. Yeah. Than couldn't open your eyes. eyes. No, 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 it's no, not bad. I don't know why. April is a special specimen. And I'm still sick. <laughs> and I feel even sicker now by sitting like Is the lactate right. building up yeah, in your body? Like... Right now, yes. Yeah, you're going green, eh? <laughs> still. I'm still recovering. Had Amy done it this morning? Uh, no, she hasn't done it yet. She's oh. doing it today as well. Okay. I think she's gonna watch everyone the salvo and then she's gonna go and do it. That's the worst way to do it. She's mm. doing straight up. It's the fact that I watched Sammy do it and she was fine. I watched Dion and Elliot Grace, they were fine. Crush it. <laughs> and then I'm like, oh, this is actually won't be too bad. Are you, gonna, are you gonna have a breakfast this morning? Before it? Yes, I'm gonna have lots of breakfast. Oh, lots of breakfast. I'm starving. What time is I'm it? I'm not on till 2.30. Yeah. It's 8 o'clock. I'm going to eat. <laughs> Don't you get really nervous? No. Oh, Jesus. And not for this. Not for this? I'm excited about it. Why do you like to do it? Why do I like to do what? The blue dinosaur throw down. You've done all three. I have done all three. Um, With a different haircut each time. Different haircut every time. Yeah, your hair looks looks sharp, by the way. I'm looking you good. Know, yeah. Did you cut you cut it real real short, eh? Yeah, I I had it. I was actually growing it longer than last year. Like it was really long. I woke up one morning, I was eating it, and I just got the shits. Who has the longest male hair in CrossFit? The longest male hair? Yeah. Well, out of the people I know. Asia Barto. Asia. Yeah. Uh, Marcus Philly. 
Oh yeah, but oh, he, yeah. Marcus. the thing is, you can't. He's got a mane. You can't have fucking long hair next to that guy. Like, cause he has the most beautiful hair you've ever seen. So he's got a mane, and he's a beautiful guy. Uh, oh, did you do figure skating? Yeah. <laughs> oh, you skating. are officially a loser. <laughs> uh, excuse me. That's how I can pistol so well. Yeah. See that carry over to CrossFit? <laughs> <laughs> Better than ballet. Why are you wearing a beanie? It's cold. Oh, it is a bit cold. It's How do you decide what to wear for your workout? Um, it's a, uh, I have a selection process. Do you think about it a lot? No, not a lot, but I would lie if I didn't say I thought about it. If I didn't say that I thought about it a little. I always wear stance socks. So Asian. So many cracks. Stance socks. Me and Lockie. What are you doing? Just freshening up. <laughs> Just freshening up. A shot last day, please. Shot yes, please. Thank you. Well, have you done the work? Coffee, Coffee you don't drink. <laughs> oh, okay, cool. So, so we can't hang out anymore. I used to when I worked at Virgin, but yeah. I don't even. I ain't woke up anymore. Coffee is the only thing that matters. Yeah. You are pathetic. Yeah. Is it because it's so bitter? Oh, yeah. How do you do that syrup? It's so good. Yeah. Really so People come up to me and ask, like, how should I strategize this workout? I don't even know how to put the down my workout. So I try and ask you. Yeah. And they go, 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 and they said it, yes. <laughs> She's like, she should definitely be doing RXD. And we're all like, oh, okay, I'll change it. No, I just have no clue. But I've never done weights before in my whole entire life. Do you go back and ice skate every now and then? I want to, I want to. You should take Sammy with you. She's really gracious on the ice. I actually used to roll that Kim, so. <laughs> I could still do the jumps and everything, but. Is that how you met Kirk? Was he your partner? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't imagine him doing ice skating. Uh, no, me and Kurt met on Facebook. When did they tell you to reach out? Yeah, we're in the what are you reading? Um, a friend of mine who doesn't do CrossFit did this running thing where you like run with other girls around the world and you like listen to the same music and run the same distance at the same time. And you just like posted a photo of us leaving that. Yeah, just like oops, pretty much. Do you wish you were doing the workout today with Tracy? Um, no. Because it's more fun supporting someone than it is doing a workout with them. It's a little bit stressful. So if I can make her less stressed, then that's a better outcome than both of us being stressed. Was she stressed this morning? Um, she'll, she'll say that she's not, but I know that she is. Are you stressed, Tracy? Um, I'm jealous. I wish I was finished. Everyone else is finished and they're all complaining about how sore they are. It's not, it's not exciting. No. But, it's but it'll be over quick. Yeah. Yeah. It's a good chance. Good trip over for eight minutes of rowing and thrusters. <laughs> are you going to beat Jamie? Yes. <laughs> Definitely. We'll see how she goes on her redo. <laughs> Contrary to popular belief, we don't make a lot of money. How much money did you make last year in prize money? No. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Not much. Zero? Not much. Oh. You okay. got a bit for the podium. It'd be, week, a, it'd, be, it'd, be, it'd be a couple of thousand dollars, so I have no idea what the actual figure would be. Not a lot. So how do you pay your rent, Tony? I have a job. I am a coach. Does Matt Swift pay you well? He pays me well. <laughs> When can you ask for a pay rise for them? Uh, when I feel I'm doing a good enough job. <laughs> Are you still just an intern there? or? I'm the lead trainer at CrossFit Brisbane. Uh, there's a couple of us, there's a couple of lead trainers, but I'm more often than not the lead trainer on the floor. Is Kelsey Swift a better trainer than you? Yes. So I'm holding this for 30 seconds. Like that. 
<laughs> no, I really wish that's 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 that's
the mind fuck that everyone wants to buy into it. Like, I'll put up, I don't know, me hurting outside my gym, but like not put my score. And then I just find it's not really the top guys, it's not the top 10, it's like the people trying to make regionals, like the CrossFit fans, like, I don't know, they just buy into it and they enjoy that sort of unknown and sort of suspense. So, yeah, that's kind of cool. Do you get a lot of people asking about your scores after they know you've done it? And then do you tell them or do you not tell them? I tell some people, I'm selective, that's who I tell. Yeah, this year I haven't really got any random sort of inboxes or messages, just like my close friends and family, I just tell them my score. And if I'm working with anyone or training partners, I try and help them out and give them strategy and tips and stuff. But that's about it. Do you ever lie about your score? <laughs> <laughs> Lucky, it's uh, about an hour before we open the doors. Are you ready? I'm, I was born ready. <laughs> I was born ready. Bro, you know we're always ready. It's easy to be ready when you know it's ever It's easy prepared. to be ready when you put down 500 mils of cold brew coffee in one second. Two minutes. How's Sammy's hips feeling? A little bit tight, Kimbo. Just getting these loosened up for her. Too tight for a 7-10 finish? Uh, I think too. They'll be loose enough. Yeah. Too good. What did you think when this workout came out? Uh, yeah, it's a lot of pain. I could just imagine the pain. <laughs> I know it's just going to be a massive burner. I wasn't. I'm not really excited about the workout. I don't think it's a very exciting workout per se. Like it's not, but it's gonna hurt a lot. I'm excited to watch you in this workout because you're gonna hurt so badly. I'm gonna make myself hurt a lot. Yes, I don't intend to walk away from it. <laughs> do you have a Do you have a goal? I do have a goal. I do have a goal. Uh, I've more, more. You know, more than a goal. I have a plan. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Um, is, is that goal under 550? It's, it's all, I always aim for, yeah, like, yeah, I guess yeah, so. You set a high goal. Yeah, I have to set the high goal. So, if I, you know, if you hit it, it's amazing. If you fall just short, then you fall just short because you push towards that goal, you know? So. Do you hope Chase beats Kieran and Chris? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Why wouldn't I? <laughs> He's not allowed to beat me. How do you feel about competing against Chase again? Uh, should be good fun. Should be good fun. Provided I beat him by a lot. It should be, <laughs> should be heaps of fun. <laughs> hey, at least he won't beat you on the leaderboard, whatever happens. Ah, uh, yeah, he, uh, he I'm winning, I'm winning, hey, I'm winning in the people who are disqualified. He's, he, you actually do. That's you all that him, And you beat him at Healy in yeah, that Yeah, I claim that. He's good. He's gonna win on the girls. Today. <laughs> the boys? Is BD Throwdown. BD Throwdown is your official hashtag for today's event. Right, the athletes are in the process of getting warmed up now. So we're going to start off the event with the brothers, the Frankenfeld versus the Hogan. You know what I mean? Yeah. So that's what gets in the way, not the person who got to the second. <laughs> Yeah, it's the other people because they get in your say you were going for they get in your diet so there's 150 people who have legit spots. That's yeah. how How's your health? It's not the best, but hopefully I've got enough fitness to last six minutes <laughs> or seven minutes. This is the second year you've done the Blue Dinosaur well Throwdown? Yeah, second year. Um, Why do you choose to do it? I think it's just a good way to celebrate the end of the open. I mean, everyone gets pretty over it, I think, by this, by like, anyone that's sort of going to regionals is pretty over it by the fifth week. So it's good to do something to mix it up, yeah. keep it fresh. Yeah. Do you think it affects your score in any way, like up or down? Uh, yeah, it definitely could. Um, I think with something like this, it's going to help you though. Um, Did it help you last year? Yeah, it definitely helped me because. I oh, know. Towards the end, it probably helped me a little bit. Um, because I train so much by myself, I think I'm pretty good at pushing. Like, yeah. Yeah, but it definitely helped, like, through the 15s and the 9s, just to get that extra bit of pace on this one. Like, the 15, the 9, the ones where you're going to want to back off, but you need to push, and having this environment is going to make you get that little bit, which might shave two, three seconds off, or something like that. It's all going to help. You, it looks like you're going to win the Open this year. 
Is there a prize for that? I don't think so. Hey, you get to wear hashtag number one at regionals. <laughs> That's about it. Oh yeah. <laughs> Holy shit, you can like chill out. Yeah, mate. You didn't seem 100% confident before uh, the, this workout. Obviously, flying in from the Cook Island yesterday, and then from Sydney today. Yeah. Oh, I was uh, pretty tired. If you saw me, everyone was like all dancing around. I was just sitting yeah. on my rower, kind of going, you idiot. Why do you do this to yourself? I was a bit concerned for you right at the beginning before you walked out, but uh, clearly, I didn't have anything to be concerned about. Well, that's just a short workout, man. Like, that's. If it was a longer one, it probably would have affected me more. But the fact was, I didn't really realise how hard it was and how much it hurt. Uh, during the actual thing, like mental, that worked out in my mind. It was all mental for me. I know I'm a good rock. I know that I can row relatively hard and it not hurt too much. Benny was moving real quick, so that made it kind of like I would always get off the roller ahead of him, but I knew his thrusters were faster than me, so. 
that kind of made me push a little harder than I would have probably done on my own with the thrusters. <laughs> and it hurt so bad. Like, I've never hurt like that after a workout. I lost, like, all bodily functions. Have you seen that, uh, the, the Wolf of Wall Street? Yeah. Like, that, that scene, so, like, there's, like, the different stages of being drunk. Yeah. I transcended, like, the, the drunkest I've ever been after that workout. Just, like, went full-blown cerebral palsy. <laughs> I don't know if that's politically correct, but it's in a movie, so I can say it. And then kind of gain, like, you know, every second counts in this one. Gain yeah. a few seconds. So I went, rip. Bum goes off the seat. At first I thought the seat was behind me, so I grabbed it. Like it went off the seat, kind of Bjorn, my judge, was like yelling, he's like, get on, you have a go on, get on, you're all right, you're all right. So I just got on, and then I ripped it. Like, it was kind of almost a blessing in disguise, because like, you've got like four seconds you've got to make up on these boys now, and it's going to be tight. Yeah. So I just ripped it as hard as I could, and I had the rower, uh, don't quote me on this, but I heard that it got up to like 3,400 or so <laughs> calories, <laughs> but it was like, I was giving it some, I think. And that's the, on your first roll. Yeah, 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 yeah. So I had it around between, I thought it was around the 3,000, a bit over 3,000 to like 2,200 cal for about the first 11 calories. And then I kind of knew that that would have given me enough time to catch up to the boys. And then I dropped it back to what I wanted to roll out, which is about 850, 1850. Yeah. And I uh, just kind of held that for the rest of it. And, and it was just all heart from there. Like just, I think I posted right after this was announced, 15.5 is how much do you hate yourself for time? You did. And I just, you know, did not like myself very much at the end of that work. <laughs>